children when we were small we used to sit together and listen to shushil doshi and ravi chaturvedi's radio commentary on every cricket match that india played abroad each syllable and every exclamation we heard on radio made us feel like the match was unfolding right before us even though the medium of communication was solely audio based you must be thinking why all of a sudden i started talking about all this yes today unesco is celebrating 11th edition of world radio day the theme of 2022 edition of this special day is radio and trust in recent years despite of global decline in trust in internet and social media Radio is found to be one of the most trustworthy medium of information. On this occasion, I would like to share few interesting facts about radio in India. In the year 1929, India got its first radio. Radio sets were imported to India and initially two radio stations were set up, one in Bombay and second one in Calcutta. for news broadcasting only the bbc began its broadcast in india in 1930s on june 8 1936 all india radio was established since 1957 it is officially known as akashvani and this name was given by ravindranath tagore azad hind radio was a propaganda radio service started under the leadership of netaji subhash chandra bose in germany in 1942 to encourage indians to fight for freedom now let us talk more about all india radio today all india radio has 415 radio stations and in 23 languages and 416 dialects It has 99% population coverage and 18 FM channels. It is one of the largest broadcaster of the world. All India Radio's first ever news bulletin was broadcast on January 19, 1936, and the national musical program on All India Radio was broadcast on July 20, 1952. The Vividh Bharati service was on air on 3rd October 1957. It was one of the most popular service by All India Radio. The show held Amin Sayani to become the most popular radio jockey till date. Signature tune of All India Radio was composed by Walter Kaufman, a Czech Jewish refugee. This proves that music is truly a universal language and it does not know any barrier. The Shahanshah of Bollywood was rejected after an audition with All India Radio so AR is indirectly responsible for giving India its most popular superstar Amitabh Bachchan Today also a lot of people listen to radio mainly because it is affordable it brings the young old poor rich everyone together Radio provides high quality entertainment Do you know Listening to the morning news on radio remains one of the most widely reported habits across the globe. Radio has been the last man standing in times of calamity and disaster. During 2004 tsunami and 2013 Uttarakhand floods, radio played a stellar role in providing information on relief work, aid and recovery efforts when networks were down and phone lines were cut. Radio. This source of entertainment has a lot of advantages in a country as diverse as India. TV and films are in few languages. In India, there are over 180 local community radio stations which operate in languages of most tribes and communities. Rural India relies on this medium heavily for information. Our country still struggling to achieve higher and better literacy. 
Radio acts as a medium to give knowledge and information even to the illiterate. Radio Mirchi in Mumbai and Delhi has a weekly listenership about 7 million people. Our Prime Minister uses radio for his Man Ki Baat so that he can reach every part of our country no matter how remote it is. From All India Radio speakers with a steady tone to playing peppiest Bollywood numbers, radio has learned to evolve with people. Survey says 159 million radio listeners are there in India in compared with 176 million internet users. Today, the spread of internet is not competition for radio. but rather is supporting development radio stations have started launching websites so radio is not a technology that will become obsolete it still remains the cheapest and the most reliable source of entertainment and information it adapts with changing technologies and new trends radio is now accessible through laptops computers phones and even smart speakers so You can tune your favorite station whenever and wherever you want. TV gives everyone an image, but radio gives birth to a million of images in a million of brains. It is the most powerful tool that informs, transforms and unites us. Radio is about companionship and emotional connection with the listeners. On this occasion of World Radio Day, we must remember that inventions never vanish. They just keep on changing their formats and evolving. Bring the world closer and honor radios. Happy World Radio Day.